his mouth? No. Jinja <laughs> said. What's up guys? Fresh out of the tough house, feeling really good. Uh, you know, it was a long process, three months. So, uh, you know, I just got out, got my phone back, put on my phone a little bit, talked to my mom, my dad. You know, I got a couple of, you know, loved ones in town right now. I feel great. I'm fighting on uh, Chris Saunders uh, this upcoming Friday. Crazy, I got so much on my plate right now, uh, you know, with the fight coming up and, you know, just coming out of that, that three, you know, that three months in that house and then coming straight into all this stuff. I got so many people that are, you know, hitting me up and I'm trying to keep in contact with everybody and it's, you know, it's hard because I'm still focused on, you know, like my weight and, you know, make sure, I, you know, I'm, I'm still finally tuned for my fight and everything. So it's pretty crazy. It's pretty hectic right now. But uh, like I said, I, I feel like it's making me a better fighter and a, and a better person altogether. Uh, I can't feel any better. You know, I had a great training camp, no injuries. Uh, you know, like I said, I, I feel really good right now. So just, you know, fine tuning everything and enjoying my, you know, time here in Vegas, enjoying my time out of the house and staying focused. And uh, looking to get, looking forward to get my first UFC win this Friday. Uh, the house, it was pretty challenging, man. You know, mentally, mentally, physically. Uh, you know, it's a lot of things going on there. You know, of course, being away from my family. You know, having no contact. You know, being in a house full of uh, a bunch of guys that you, you know, you don't know who you're gonna fight and whatnot. And then just training hard. You know, with the cameras on you 24/7. You got a list. You can order whatever you want. But uh, you know, it's like. It's kind of like a double-edged sword. I got, I can order whatever I want, but then I can't though, because I'm on my diet and I gotta watch what I eat. And uh, you know, like at the house, you gotta call somebody to get get a, a shaver so I can shave. I gotta call somebody to come turn the lights off at night. So uh, you know, now I can actually turn the lights off whenever I want, and I can I can shave whenever I want. So that's good. It was really challenging, but I mean, I feel like, feel like I grew up a lot as a person and as a fighter. And uh, you know, like the fighter I am today compared to you know the fighter I was three months ago, I feel a lot more improved. And just a lot more mentally strong and you know I feel like I'm, I'm really on my path right now and uh, like I said I'm ready for this next fight uh, you know kind of get a little bit over, overwhelmed coming out of the show a little bit so much stuff going on especially you know jumping right into another fight uh, but you know I'm, I'm dealing with the pressure you know it's you know certain things that I'm just I'm learning as I'm you know growing up as, as a fighter and especially now at the UFC level so you know it's like like to make that diamond you gotta it takes a lot of pressure so Feeling good though, so I can't wait to uh, you know get my first UFC win. Like I said, next Friday I watch some fights on right now on uh, Chris Saunders, really tough opponent, but I feel like you know I'm more well-rounded and it's my time.